it's your main man case today i gotta test course 2 yesterday i installed the Voltra. today i removed some anti-aliasing shenanigans we had 15 fps in a demo i expect this to go way up hopefully i am correct and 15 fps is the worst part this was 30 right now 31 40 yeah so that's already a slight increase which is pretty pretty nice um and 64 games running above 30 fps was not really a thing back then so i am pretty happy with this but what i mainly care about is how much the worst part improved okay the fact that it shows 30 fps here is pretty amazing all right this was what the worst part was. okay that is an insane increase 15 to 23 holy fuck how much is it without that render thing 23 no it's 22 so you always gotta add like one fps i guess for all the numbers holy shit so this is uh, way better now you can expect the same kind of improvement in some of the other levels not everywhere this was one of the levels that insanely benefited from removing aa I think just Lip Ultra added like 1 or 2 FPS and DAA added the rest. So I also want to try all the other areas here just to see how they kind of fare. Uh, what the? Huh? I must have accidentally given this alpha texture here a collision. Oops. That is easy to fix. Just a stupid dumb bug on my part. Uh, let's check the area inside that dome next. That one's gonna be a favorite area. That is my most popular video on this channel. And I think it's gonna run really really well because it's such a small area. That's actually gonna be the one thing that's gonna blow people's mind. It's gonna be like, what? How does this run so well? It looks way too high quality. one thank you let me through oh sorry if there's a background noise i'm making my quinoa and chicken it is about lunchtime here uh okay that is simply me not clearing the frame buffer yep 40 fps that's what i thought oh i do keep the bomb suit here i gotta change that code I don't want the player to bring the bombs in with them. I wonder how much like the bombs add. Yeah, when looking up they add quite a lot because they add up like the whole screen. Alright, looking pretty well. Some render areas were a bit weird. But that is all easy fixes. I'm just gonna change some numbers. Nothing tough at all. Next, let's check inside the turtle. There are many areas in every level I make. Some of them have eight areas. So this level, this game is insanely much bigger than the original one. 32! In this area, that is amazing. 20, okay, this is the worst angle. I think it was 18 before, now it's 22. That is very, very lovely. Yeah, I also prettied this area up a bit from the previous version, as you may notice, hopefully. Wait, at the end it was 50 FPS when I was working out, I guess because I was looking at nothing. Um, next area... Oh, I guess we can check out the deep sea. This is gonna be a pretty boring area to check out, because this is just obviously gonna be like 40 FPS. Without even thinking about it. Oh, oh, oh! I gotta fix my health. I got a button to fill my health up for like testing. Almost died. 38. Yeah. No further questions. That was pretty much the worst angle already. No worry about that one. Where? There. I made this pipe so big so that you can enter it easily because Entering this pipe sucked with the old swimming physics. 
But with the new ones, it's like, whatever. Oh, never mind. I guess it still sucks. 36, okay. You may notice that 36 looks somewhat more stuttery than 30. That's because the frames are not as evenly spaced out. So by default it's just gonna max out at 30 on N64. But knowing how much higher it could go is still good for us. So we know like how lenient it is. Right, how bad of an angle on the camera you could have and still be fine. At 55 FPS, come on. That is just silly. Yeah, so this whole Lip Ultra improvement adds so much to this, it's insane. Because now our thread switching works probably. Oh, that's another one, I cleared frame buffer. Thread switching works probably. And with this, the, the anti-aliasing properly fixed, we have less issues with that too. So everything's just way better. But even this overworld here, everything. I do want to check out Course 3 next, so that's going to be another video soon. But for now, I'm saying goodbye. Bye-bye.